Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is part 4 of Tableau interview series. If you have not watched previous video of the series, I recommend you to go and watch the previous video as it is quite helpful for the interview. I will provide the link of the series in the description box as well as the link of the questions. So let's get started. So the first question is, what are the different actions in Tableau? So action is an interactive element on the Tableau dashboard that is driven from within the worksheet. So there are five types of actions, filter actions, highlight action, go to URL, go to sheet, change parameter and change sets value. Okay. So the second question is, what are the dashboard objects in Tableau? There are various dashboard objects in Tableau, horizontal, vertical, text, image, web page, blank, navigation, download and extension. These dashboard objects are very useful to make dashboard interactive and easy to use for the users. Okay, let's move to the next question. So the next question is, which is better layout in Tableau? Tableau has two dashboard layout, floating and tied layout from which floating layout is better because floating allows us to define the size and the exact location of the charts in the dashboard. But in the tied layout, size of the charts depends on the size of dashboard and the object around it okay let's move to the next question so the next question is what is basql in tableau so whenever we drag and drop any field in the tableau interface so each action generates a query that is translated into basql language and shows the tableau visual okay let's move to the next question so the next question is what is the difference between table calculation and the calculated field table calculation reside in our tableau interface or we can say it is inbuilt feature of tableau on the other hand calculated fields are created on data and appears as a separate column in the data source examples of table calculations are running total difference from yui growth moving average percentage change etc and uh, it is subset of calculated field okay let's move to the next question so the next question is what is LOD function and its type. So LOD is level of details. It is used to run complex queries involving many dimension at the data source instead of bringing all the data in the tableau interface. So there are three types of LOD, fix LOD, include LOD, ex exclude LOD. I will create a separate video on LOD, how to create LOD and how to use it. Okay. Let's move to the next question. So the next question is, what is the difference between publish and embedded data source? Whenever we require same data source to build multiple workbooks, so we directly push the data source to the Tableau server or Tableau public and connect all the workbook to it. Whenever we refresh the data source, all the workbooks connected to the data source will get updated data. But in the embedded data, data source, instead of publishing the data source to the server, we publish the data source along with the workbook whenever we refresh the data source only that specific workbook is updated okay that's all guys thank you so much if you like the video please do like comment and subscribe and please share it with your friends and stay tuned for more interesting videos thank you